have waited 16 months for this and we are officially crossing the Nullarbor today. Yeah. Um, towing the caravan, so we're gonna bring you guys along for it and I hope you enjoy. All right, we are at Penong. Our first kind of stop. We did have to have another stop for a little wee wee break for COVID, didn't we, mate? And we're here at this cool park and it's got a crazy little windmill thing that you could easily slice your head on. Pretty standard regional Australia. All right, so we're at Yalata. We've just filled up for the first time since Treaky Bay. It only cost us a hundred bucks, which is amazing. I was probably down, <laughs> bloody flies. I was probably down maybe just about three quarters. So it worked out perfect. Now we're gonna find somewhere for lunch. We have just remembered we've got to throw out a heap of crappy food to get into Western Australia because they have stringent laws on fruit and vegetables and bark. Hold on, let's, oh, let's flippies, let's flippies. What do we got, babe? We don't have too much. We don't have too much. So, they used to know the Nullarbor. We're finally here. Aren't we, Kiko? Poor guys have been pooped out. Big drive today, as you can see. Bit of a tourist attraction. Um, bit of fun. So I just stopped, we've been travelling now for five hours. We just stopped um, at Bunda Cliffs at the whale place. Anyway, um, I'm just making some lunch for everyone. Anyway, now I'm just heating it up and I'm gonna put it on these wraps here and put some cheese on it and lunch is done. I'm gonna have another one. Are you? Yeah, you can make it. <laughs> How about you make it? Mommy, oh, I did you fart. can make it. <laughs> you make it. I did fart. What? So we're about to cross over into WA. So exciting. Here's all the checkpoints. So, the fun, fun deal, we're at the border. We've probably passed maybe 10 different sites that you could stay at overnight for free, right on the edge of the world. And a piece of Ella has died every time because I refuse to stay there because I want to get through to the border. And it's been slightly amusing to watch that. All right, I've lucked out. Passenger Princess is happy with the spot, even though her spirits were dying looking at all those others on the cliff edges. She's happy with where we've got. <laughs> we'll show some stuff. First night on the Nullar Ball, done and dusted. What a gorgeous spot. And Ella's got the duties this morning. God, oh my gosh. We're at Eucla or Eusla. We, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's been good. It's 6.30 now, and uh, it's time to hit the road. You've been on the 90 mile street yeah, for a while. Been a while. Coming into Baldonia, Baladonia. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it. This is our second time filling up today. We're only at half a tank this time. Had a big one. Oh, Kaguna or somewhere, cost 145. This one was heaps cheaper, which is good. And, uh, and we're gonna head to Norseman, see how far we get. It's a bit raining and a bit miserable, so. Uh, and the kids are yelling at me to get ice cream, so I better get it. We've been traveling for nine hours today. Oh gosh, what a long day. Almost 10 hours of traveling today. It's 
So this place is like three minutes out of, oh, I reckon like five minutes out of Norseman. So nice. What are you doing? You're painting? Yeah. Oh. I hope that doesn't stain. Huh? I hope that doesn't stain. All right. We have driven a long, long freaking way today. And so the first thing we're going to do right now is go on an adventure up this hill, get the kids' legs walking, and, uh, and see how far we can get up. See if we spot any dingoes or emus or kangaroos or something. After an absolutely intense day of driving with wind and rain and bumps and all of it, we are absolutely treated to a stunning sunset. So I'm gonna show just, just divine right now. Last day traveling, gonna be absolutely mega, probably 10 hours on the road. We've stayed at this epic camp spot, got the coffee. <laughs> Kids are in the car. Played a bit of soccer this morning. Had a bit of a run around, but gorgeous view. No wind, looks like a perfect day to travel. So we're here at Southern Cross, our second last stop on this trip, having some lunch. Parked up in this, what well, would be normally a dust bowl if there wasn't any rain recently the kids are out playing in the mud fun one of the funnier things about being married to ella is her ability just to have a billion things at her feet while we drive she's about to drive i'm like where do i sit where do i put my legs not long to go now probably How are we doing in the back, kids? Guys, we've got six minutes until we get to Perth. I mean, we're in Perth, but our caravan park. How you going, babe? I'm cooked. <laughs> Three days from Adelaide, no, Streaky Bay to Perth. I'm that we did it. Good Anyway, thanks for joining us on our adventure and we can't wait to show you more of our lives. <laughs>